of you who don't know, Mermaid Crate is a subs- Ugh. Hi everyone, this is Krisha from Third World Book Nerd and welcome to our first vlog episode. Okay. So as we talk, as we're filming, it's the first day of March. It's officially summer and for the summer, you'd want to have a very good read. Otherwise, it's just going to be boring. It's just going to be another boring summer day. So earlier today, I finally got the call and the male guys, the Koya mailman, finally told me that my my package has already arrived. So yay, now we're doing an unboxing. I can't wait to show you guys um, what I have. So for those of you who don't know, um, Mermaid Crate is a subscription box based in the Philippines. Um, if you're familiar with Owl Crate or Fairy Loot, that fairy loot they're basically the Philippine equivalent so each month they roll out a theme and post some clues about the book that they're gonna feature for that month so it's basically um, a mystery box and it's um, inside the box is a hardbound book plus goodies from local um, artists and crafts people so it's really um, quite exciting. I may say so myself. So without further ado, let's open this box. I'm kind of stupid with this. The dumbest person when it comes to unboxing stuff. So please bear with me. So cute. What I like about it is that the box isn't kinda normal or a box. It's actually like a treasure box thingy. Or a book. I think it's shaped like a book. So yeah. So cute! I love how, how much thought they put into this one. I love things that are really well thought out. So thank you, Mermaid Crate, for designing your box like this. Um yeah. Let's take a look at what's inside. Ah! Oh my gosh. So when you open the box, this is what you get. Cute! Okay, let's go through the items one by one. Let's go through the items one by one. So here... What is this? Oh, okay, it opens here. Ha, <laughs> I'm an idiot. Oh, it has a note. So, you get a note. Let's focus on that. Nice. You get a note um, that says, Hello, Christiana. Thank you so much for... <coughs> wait, wait, let me use my um, voice over voice. <coughs> Hello, Christiana. Thank you so much for subscribing to Mermaid Crate. We are so happy that you get a part of... Ugh. Get a part of the mermaid journey. Inside our boxes, you will see amazing and magical goodies handcrafted just for you. Here at Mermaid Crate, we give every bibliophile an unforgettable moment every time you open the box. This box is filled with love and joy that you can share with anyone. We hope that opening this box will make you smile. Thank you so much for your unending love and support. Welcome to the Mermaid Pride, Mabuhay Alona. I guess Alona is a mermaid. Hi Alona. And thank you guys. It's so cute. I have an old I love it personalized stuff like this and get an art print of the theme so that January's theme is enchanted um, I know it's already March and it's a January theme this was supposed to come in um, early February but there were some logistics issues um, Mermaid Crate, the staff at Mermaid Crate have been very nice so far they always provided me updates on what was going on with the box so I wasn't really worried um, about it so yeah good customer service that's always a plus in my book ah uh, so we have um, poetry by Angelica Ann Munar nice okay Look here where it's safe. So let's go through the contents of the box. I don't look at that book first. Oh my gosh. So here we have what is this? 
It's a box thingy. And more stickers. Where's my cutter? There we go. Let's cut this open. Ah. So dumb but cutters. Okay. Oh, it's a tumbler. I just have a feeling. It's a tumbler shaped package. Nice. Oh, ah, I love it. Got cute. Don't let the hard days win. It's a print from the night court. Oh my gosh, I love it. <laughs> Got cute. Magawa sa kung kuan. Magawa sa kung barik ko sa agdang sa kakiut. Okay. So this is um. It's um. What's this? This is a tumbler inspired by a court of thorns and roses. This is a quote from War, one of my one of the <clears throat> characters in the book. Yay! Thank you. I love that part. Okay, so that's nice. This ooh, the next one. Let me focus on that a bit. The sorting scarf. Um, is this Harry Potter related? <sighs> I hope so. Let's open it. My, my agtang is so shiny already because it's so limuot. I can turn on my electric fan while recording because it will be in the background. Okay. Oh my gosh, it's a scarf. I hope it's Gryffindor. I'm. I oh know, it's just a normal scarf. Okay. Yay! I'm personally a scarf person. Um, I don't like wearing jackets much because they take so much space. So, yay! I get a scarf. Thank you so much. Let me greet. Thank you, Davis. And it's a nice bookmark that says "Enchanted Influence as by Charms or Incantations." There we go. Nice, no? Um, I'm also planning to launch my own merch line. Yee! So stay tuned for that. Ooh, what's this? Some journeys takes us far from home. Some adventures leads us to our destiny by C.S. Lewis. Ooh. I think this is a bug spray. What's that? Let me open it. So here's what we've got. Close up! I think... Um, this is spray thingy. This is one of the items that they um, put um, a preview on sa ilang Instagram. Um, if you're interested in getting your own mermaid crate box, I'll put their Instagram link down below. Oh my gosh, it's so hot. I'm sweating like a pig. So it's mosquito repellent lavender flavor lavender variety oh my gosh and at the very bottom no i don't want to read that word spoiler look how cute i have a legolas art friend i was hoping for a bts one I was gonna give it to Carly, my sister, who's in love with BTS. Oh, and here we have. I think it's their necklace. Uh, Mermaid Create has a trademark mermaid necklace given to each of their subscribers. Oh, I got cute. Focus. Focus! Wait. Focus yourself. Focus. There we go. Ah, what a cute necklace. Now for the moment of truth. They actually don't let you know what the book of the month is. Um, this is before we open it. Um, that's actually my primary concern with subscription boxes like this. Because they are not, let me be honest, they're not the cheapest things to get. This one cost me about... Um, well, my one six 
plus shipping and uh, like I mentioned it's not the cheapest thing to buy um, so the thought of not knowing what book you're gonna get uh, is actually quite um, not knowing what book you're gonna get um, makes me feel weird <laughs> Okay, I mean you're gonna spend money. If you're gonna spend money, it better be something that you'd like, right? So, but this one I finally took a chance um, because primarily because their clue was that it would be great for fans of um, A Court of Thorns and Roses by Sarah J. Maas. And if you've been following me on the blog and on our Facebook page, you'd know that I'm a huge fan of Sarah J. Maas. So. Um, yeah, I felt dangerous. I just said like, yeah, let's just do it. Um, and thus we are now here. Let's see if we're gonna like this book. <laughs> I think I know what it is. Ah! Oh my gosh. Ah, yay! We've got the Cruel Prince by Holly Black in Heartbound. Ah! Yay! It still has that new book smell. And I've heard, oh my gosh, it's Lee Bardugo. She has a... Lee Bardugo had something to say about the book. I love Lee Bardugo. She's like my role model in life. I want to be as awesome as her. Dude, okay, if Lee Bardugo had something great to say about this one, I think it's worth it. Yay! And it's hardbound too. And et voila! Holly Black even has a note for us. Oh my gosh, how do they even get the author to do this? What? <clears throat> Let's just read a part of it. Do you lovely mermaid crate readers? I love changeling stories. Me too! And Cruel Prince Jude, a human being raised in fairy by the guy who murdered her parents, is kind of a reverse changeling. She's not bound by the same rule as fairies all around her. She's not a magical being who will live forever. She doesn't smell like her banana. She doesn't really have a position in the court of hygiene. Um, reading further will be a spoiler, so I'm not gonna read further. Ah, yay! All in all, I'm happy with what I got, so that's That's seven items all in all, and I think it's pretty worth the price that you're getting uh, that you got it for. So yeah, I'm really happy with what I got. I can't wait to read this book, and I hope that I'll enjoy it as much as I enjoyed um, *A Court of Thorns and Roses*. So all in all, I think this box is pretty worth it. Um, you got a lot of good items. Um, you're supporting our local artists, um, like the ones featured here in the box. They are all made by um, local artists. And you get to have a book that you can enjoy. It's hardbound. I never buy hardbound books because I'm poor. I can't afford hardbound books. I usually only buy paperback. So if you want to, um, like, do something that would excite you or um, have a really unexpected um, book yeah um, I do I recommend um, getting um, a mermaid crate box even if it's just for a month I guess you'll be very um, excited about the um, anticipation of getting a box full of goodies um, it was very well prepared by the people behind Mermaid Crate. So thank you so much guys. And also, by the way, um, even if they had some trouble with the logistics, they all they um, were always ready to follow up. The communication lines were open and I think that's really great when you're trying to run your own business. And yeah, so far my first Mermaid Crate experience has been great um, despite the delays in it coming i really actually love what i got so 
Yay! Happy dance. Happy after dance. That's it for our first vlog episode. I'm not sure how many vlogs we'll do, but stay tuned for more. Um, as always, um, keep on sharing and liking our um, page. And yeah, subscribe to our channel. We'll see you guys next time. Peace out. Bye. So, I don't know where to start. Thank you.